It's okay that she's like a distance, but it's the same thing. You need to go and see her like here. You're not going to correspond with a girl back and forth here on the local side. So you go and see her and see if you have uh, chemistry between you guys going. So same thing. So don't waste your money. You write, write letters, but not like whole bunch. Elaborate why you do not want men, men to write letters or why you think it's not the best way to find a woman. Here we go again. <laughs> <laughs> well, because you should, in many cases, you're shooting yourself in the foot by writing, oh, I mean, it's okay to write maybe a couple letters, you know, just, just say, hi, I'm such and such, I'm going to be in your city in three weeks, you know, are you available, I'd like to meet you, that, that, that's fine. Writing to someone for you know for half a year or a year or etc etc, that's kind of productive because you're gonna spend all this money on correspondence, which you could use for the trip to Ukraine or whatever country you're going. Because again, it's not particularly cheap, so you need airfare, you need hotel, you need you know all those stuff, spending money. So save it. You would need those money for follow-up trips. So instead of trying to write to a lot of different people. You cannot get to know everyone over correspondence because, yeah, you know, everybody's nice and, you know, and you start problem is you start creating the image in your head of this ideal person. You start you know, somewhat fall in love. You can pick one or two girls, start, start falling in love because in your mind they're just perfect. And then you go there, you meet them in person, and it just doesn't click. You look, you know, you sit across the table from each other, she looks at you, she, uh, you know, just... Um, it doesn't click, you know, not quite what you imagine, because just it's about chemistry, it's about connection. You know, it's just, I'm sure you've used domestic uh, dating websites, I mean, how many of you guys went on dates from Bench.com, eHarmony, Tinder, whatever, I mean, how, how many of those dates turn out to be disappointed? No matter how much you correspond with someone, you will never get to know someone over correspondence. It will never guarantee that will, you, will, you know, this person will be, you know, your life partner. So correspondence is a good tool to get to know someone just a little bit to just spark initial interest. That's it. You don't really need to go further than that. Guys, what's the most important element of a strong relationship? It's chemistry. Of course, you cannot do nothing without that. That's just the most important thing. So how in the letters you can feel that? You think you feel it and then you come to see her and nothing. You waste your time, you waste your money. You can save all that money to just to go and see her. So it's it's much, much uh, better. It's important thing to see her. And a girl would like to see her instead of writing letters back and forth, back and forth. Yeah. And I've seen that so many times on the tour too. So let's imagine we were on a three city tour, Odessa Nikolai Kherson. So somebody will totally overlook, you know, uh, girls in Odessa and Nikolai, those socials and one-on-one -on -one dates. Just no, this girl is waiting for me in her sauna. I've been writing to her for eight months. She's waiting no, for me. No, she's she is not. Yeah, and so you waste your two thirds of your tour when you don't look at the people who are in front or in front of you. Who likes you? Who wants to you know actually spend time with you? Get to know you. So you overlook that. You waste two thirds of the tour. You get to her sauna to find out this date is a failure and none of you want to. She's maybe a great person, but she's like your sister. You know, just no spark there. And what do you do? So that's why we, you know, when you you know just create those expectations, correspondence, it might not necessarily you know match it. You guys, if you go on the local side like uh, match or are you guys going to correspond for a long time, same thing. It's okay that she's like a distance, but it's the same thing. You need to go and see her like here. You're not going to correspond with a girl back and forth here on the local side. So you go and see her and see if you have. Uh, chemistry between you guys going so same thing so don't waste your money you write write letters but not like whole bunch for example if you're planning to go right now write a couple letters hey I like you I'll be there in January would like to meet and she say of course yes she'll see your picture and if she likes you she'll meet with you I'm curious as how uh, how the cost for writing a letter, a letter benefits AFA. In other words, what portion or percentage of the charges goes to AFA? Well, you know, it's still a complicated structure. Uh, you probably want to just give us a call so we can talk more about it. Because again, there are just so many details and I don't want to you know, go on a half an hour, uh, you know, talk about correspondence. So really 
as an almost. Yeah, and Tim, we actually don't recommend you to write any letters. So you guys just writing and writing, and uh, you know, it's actually we want you to go there and meet the girls right away without writing any letters. Because sometimes it doesn't work, you know. Uh, and Quite often it girls, doesn't work. Yeah, girls doesn't like just you know. How you call key Romeo? Like, yeah, keyboard Romeo. Key, yeah, keyboard Romeo. Someone uh, you see, you you know, and uh, see if they can feel something. And how you can uh, feel that in the letters? I don't understand. So we don't recommend writing any letters. Just go and see them right away. men from all over the world as they take a trip and find their future brides. Interested? Check out our website at ukrainesingles.com Don't forget to click on our red subscribe button and notice bell to get updated every time we add something new.